Um, hi. So, Dad says I get to te take, um, responsibility and lead this video a bit. Um, so... Who are you? I am Sam. Pen Kid. Pen Kid 2. Um, so we are looking at this, um, pilot. No. Or no, that's the ink. The, that's the Speech. Ink. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, the, this pen. Mm hmm which is a center pen. Yes, and this pilot ink, I mm. think yeah. by Irizuku. Um, it's called Tsuki. Sorry if I horribly butchered <laughs> that. Tsukushi. <laughs> <laughs> I horrib horribly butchered that, mm -hmm. but that's fine. Mm -hmm. It has a very nice bottle, as you can see. I like this. I like this. It. Yeah, me too. It's like a teardrop almost. Yeah. And you know why they have that? Why? Because when you... When the bot ink gets really low, you can still get your nib into that little divot and get the last bit of ink in it. Yeah. Or put a syringe into that little divot and it sucks up ink. It's nice. a real clever solution. Hmm? And it looks pretty. And it looks pretty. So um, we're going to do what? Uh, I think we should start off with an ink, with a ink, ink swatch. swatch. Mm -hmm. Just to see what it looks like. Um, So it's a brown ink, I think. It looks brown, doesn't it? <laughs> I just failed to put the swatch in. Oh, you got good ink there. Maybe it's a red, just looking Ooh. at the inside of the cap. Almost a brownie red color. Mm -hmm. Very see, nice. Can you see it again? It is a very nice. It is kind of On a... camera, it shows up a bit more brown than the... Than well, I think that's pretty it true. It does. That's pretty true. In there's kind of a red cast to that I like, you know? Yeah, there's a slight earthiness. It reminds me of the dirt of PEI, which is the place <laughs> where we live, well, our, according our, to the our, channel our, name. Mm -hmm. But um, our soil is very red, red from... It, it's redder than that. Yeah, mm -hmm. but it's kind of similar to that. You know why our soil is red? Because sandstone. Yes, what's in the sandstone? Um, What's it called? Copper? Say no. Iron oxide. Iron oxide. And it yes. rusts and turns the soil For red. For some reason I thought copper, but then our soil would be green. Actually, that's true. Copper does turn green. So, so wait, let's I should put this on first. Um, so, display the pen first. Yeah, we'll do it's a, a very video on the pen afterwards. Sleek pen, nice. We'll go it's into more detail pen. in that detail. It's a central and pen. It uh, is a twist cap. Mm -hmm. and nice nib. We'll go into more detail in the video, mm. but right now... Oh. Oops, <laughs> <laughs> Too many hands here. Yes. Yeah, um, it's, it's a good... It's a fairly simple pen. It is a piston filler. Let's mm -hmm. just focus. Yeah, piston filler. Can't focus. Um, so, yeah, it's pretty simple piston filler. So, you so dip it in. We're going to dip it in. Get the, the nib right in there. Here. Press it up, now twist it down. And twist it up again. Are we getting a fill? Not currently. Yeah. Oh, wait, you don't really have, you got to get the nib in there. And okay. So it's kind of hard to see, but yeah. as that comes down, right, uh, it causes a vacuum. Which many. then... Right. It'll try to suck air in, mm -hmm. along with ink. Okay, there, there you we go. go. I'm going to give you this to wipe that off. Ooh. <laughs> this is a bit of a messy video. I don't really know what I'm doing that much when it comes to pens, but I am doing my best. Mm -hmm. So, it's sort of, um, ooh, very nice. Mm -hmm. the, the pen hasn't been used in a little while. Focus. Mm -hmm. Can I see it? Can you write your name? <laughs> I've kind of run out of hey, room on the page, I've but... I've you over a sheet. Yeah. Um... I probably can sign my name. Oh, that's a pretty color. Can I try it? Yeah. So, yeah, it's, um, yeah, so, Irashizuku, and it is, Tsutsuki. No, Tsukushi. 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 We're, we're both 
terrible at pronouncing things. We are butchering it. We're butchering it. But anyway, it's a beautiful ink. I like. I, and it, oh, that's very nice, isn't it? So what you see is a. Uh, it looks like a nice intense color. I have horrible handwriting. Isn't it right? And it. I like kind of burgundy red inks, and this is kind of a brown, but it also has a nice bit of red to it, which yeah, I really like. It's pleasant. And uh, the quick brown. Flops, jumps over the lazy dog. Looks nice. Yeah. And this pen writes very well. It has pretty good smooth um line variation. Ooh, yeah. It, yeah, actually it's that's really good line variation. Mm -hmm. It writes smooth and if we take if a look that. here. Yeah. It um doesn't break. The feed keeps up, yeah. It broke just a that bit was just, there. Yeah, that wasn't the ink's fault. But that thought. wasn't the ink's yeah, fault just, or the pen's mm -hmm. fault. I just kind of didn't. And if we just kind of scribble it there, um, I want to say I'd call that a fairly wet ink since it goes oh, yeah. down fairly. Mm -hmm. And there's a wet pen. It yeah. goes down fairly thick, mm -hmm. but the ink's fairly wet. Do you it like the color? It smudges away a lot. Yeah. If you had to it's say, nice... what, would, what would you assume is your favorite color of ink? Writer's blood. Writer's blood. Because you like the name or the color? A combination of the two. You like writer's, also... diamine, writer's blood. Yes. I like that one too. It's and actually, you know what? You know favorites. what? Like, I can, there's a similarity in some way. Writer's blood is lighter and more... Uh, it has that more sense reddish. of muddiness yes. in a sense. Mm -hmm. You could say all... Yeah. So there's this is a nice beautiful brown, oh, and, and I gotta lovely. admit, like brown inks are something I don't have a lot of. We have walnut. Yeah. Other than that, not much. We have some reds that are yellow, kind of coppery Brownish. colors. Yeah. But this is the first like and it's really beautiful. good brown ink, and I quite like that ink. Walnut's pretty good, yeah. but this it has to be my favorite brown ink we have. I so think far. so, yeah. And you know what? I like it's to match my just pens. Just very nice, right? It fits very well with this pen. And yeah, so this is kind of a. Actually, there's a lot of really interesting things about this pen. We're going to do a little video after this one about it. Yeah. But anyway, that's the... You know, Pilot makes some beautiful inks. I love Pilot. They make beautiful pens. I like Pilot, like, a lot. And, Pilot's uh, great. Yeah, and the Arashizuku... Uh, <laughs> yes, I'm probably saying that wrong. Uh, you know, I, I actually think this color might be discontinued, actually. Suzuki. Ooh. Sakushi. So uh, I'm. it might be discontinued. I, I, I was looking online. Somebody had told me that earlier. Hmm. And I was looking online. I didn't see it mentioned, but it might now be discontinued. I don't know. Anyway, but anyway, beautiful packaging. That's one of the things that, that's really startling about these. Like, when it, this runs down, it's not the type of bottle you would throw away. Yeah. You would try to use that for something or just display it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's definitely a kind of bottle that you'd want to keep around, do something yeah. with. And, you know, people in the in the hobby like to collect things. So they keep uh, beautiful bottles that are, that, that are that, that, you know, that they've what collected I've learned or found. What I've learned is pen fans will collect anything if it can be useful whatsoever mm -hmm. with pens. <laughs> That's true. You know? Mm -hmm. Like... Not even useful. If it's just relatively associated with pens, they'll collect it. Like, paper. Paper. You wouldn't really think much about paper, because a good pen should be able to write well on any paper. Mm -hmm. But people still love good paper. Well, <laughs> Which makes sense, because very, the better the paper, the better the, better the writing, writing experience. And the better everything goes. And it looks pretty. Notebooks are supposed to look good and be nice. To write on and you want to keep them mm -hmm. which yeah it's a lot of nuance yeah. in the one thing I, yeah one thing i liked about the bottles even though it's a narrow bottle it's actually really stable i was I, i've noticed that about these bottles like sometimes you'll have a bottle and you're like and i'm always kind of worried that it might tip like yeah. even like the noodlers bottles they're kind of mm -hmm. you know square but they're quite tall and i'm often worried yeah. that i'll knock one over and this kind uh, of bottle has so much glass yeah, at the bottom, I don't think I could. It has a it. really good base. And the Ferris wheel press, even though they're nice bottles, there's like a small little section on the bottom where the where the, where it sits. It's 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 a kind of a rounded shape. Yeah. And it's quite narrow. And I like, often worry about tipping them over. I have
had to put some force into that to knock it over. Yeah. If you just glance by it, it's more likely to just push uh, yeah. back. You can tip over any bottle of ink, yeah. but this is a well-designed be really package. Mm -hmm. Because it has that, so you won't run out of ink as easily. Mm -hmm. or, well, you'll be able to use up the last little bit. Yeah. It looks appealing. I like it the, has a lot this, of glass I like the, the simplicity of it's the design. It's very nice. And I also love, you know, the simplicity of the bottles and, and the... And the uh, boxes like um sometimes things can be overly designed yeah you know? i definitely agree there's a minimalist quality to this that's yes nice. mm. honestly i love bottles it's mm -hmm. a weird thing but i'm a huge fantasy nerd and sucker so, for that kind of thing so mm -hmm. like potion bottles and that kind of stuff i'm really for interested cosplay. in just like how bottles and a things medicine can chest. look so yeah, maybe, like this kind of thing. Maybe is I'll really give you a couple empty bottles sometime. I would love that. Yeah, or, <laughs> but or, like that kind or maybe of thing somebody, is really you know, interesting. Uh, maybe we can get appealing. you a couple empty bottles somewhere. Bottles I, I, are nice. I'll ask around. People I'm are always in bottles. having bottles, so I'll get you some for your cosplay. I love bottles. All right. So anyway, I think that's wrapping it up for the video. Yeah. What are you gonna say? Um, have a nice day, everyone. Um, like, subscribe recommend stuff to us in the comments just take a chat what it's do people nice. do with their bottles um do they yeah. display them do they put things in them do you do they throw them away new inks in them oh interesting like i don't know mm -hmm. uh tell us what you do with your bottles do you mix your own inks people some people do blending yeah and and, and some people make their own pens like i heard there's a guy on pei mm -hmm. Who um, made his own wooden pens. Yeah. I saw an article about it. Yeah, people can do it. So anyway, thanks a lot. Yeah, have a great day, everyone. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.